In this video, we are going to take a look at the world's first Dutch built steel hulled electric trawler yacht. This game changing trawler yacht has only recently been launched and at the time of making this video is undergoing sea trials. But let us take a closer look at this ocean going explorer. Make sure that you stay tuned because as well as talking about some of the technical specifications of this yacht, we will also be taking a look at her interior. The Steeler 61S was launched on the 20th of December. She is the first ocean going fully electric powered trawler yacht and has been built by Steeler Yachts. With batteries becoming lighter and more robust with greater charging capacity, recharge costs are becoming cheaper and free in some ports. The battery pack aboard the Steeler 61S extends across the full beam of the boat. The engine space of the Steeler 61S electric trawler contains a state-of-the-art drive system comprising a lithium-ion powered Hydesta 120 electric motor. Before we take a closer look at this groundbreaking trawler yacht, please do not forget to subscribe to my channel as 85% of the people who watch this will forget to. The battery sets comprise 18 containers, each with 16 cells, giving this trawler yacht hours of fossil fuel free cruising. When the batteries need recharging, a 110 horsepower Volvo generator provides the power. The batteries are charged in two hours, so that the generator only needs to work two hours during a 10 hour cruise. Steeler developed the boat with a previous client who sailed 7,000 nautical miles with a 2.66 litre per mile consumption. But the client wanted better. He did not want any footprint and asked Steeler if they could build an ocean going electric motor yacht and Steeler rose to the challenge. Having built over 100 custom created trawler and explorer yachts over the years, Steeler used their experience to create this beautiful electric trawler yacht with its CE Category A rating. She has a length overall of 18.6 meters, which is 61 feet. Her waterline length is 17.8 meters. She has a beam of six meters and a draft of 1.8 meters. She has a displacement of 70,000 kilograms. Her accommodation comprises six berths in three cabins. She has a water capacity of 2,498 liters and her propulsion consists of a line shaft with a five bladed propeller. She is made of steel and the world renowned Vripak Design Studio designed her exterior and interior. The 61S also features the Dutch builder European Powerboat of the Year Award flat floor panorama concept, which makes it one of the most spacious explorer yachts in its size, thanks to the use of single level living. The triple deck makes this trawler yacht an impressive and distinctive vessel. Its silhouette is shaped by the bow and the streamlined length of the hull itself. Add to that the coupe style cabin tapering backwards with the flying bridge towering on top and you have a beautiful looking trawler yacht with neat modern lines that draw the eye to every feature of her hull and superstructure. The principle of the triple deck flat floor design is based on the Steeler vision of single level living whereby the owner has full command forward to aft of the saloon galley and master bedroom on the single level middle deck without any stairs or height differences. The top deck houses the wheelhouse with a state-of-the-art entertainment area that is freely connected to the open rear deck. The lower deck is home to two guest cabins, each with its own ensuite. suite. 
Some of the features which I love about this electric trolley yacht include the forward raking windows on the wheelhouse which help to reduce glare and help to prevent water from lingering for too long on the windows when motoring through big seas. I also love the straight up and down bow which can punch through big seas with minimal effort thanks to her steel hull. I love the defenders because they give that added peace of mind when you are operating a boat either on your own or with one other crew member. The aft boat deck on this trolley yacht is also big with a clutter and obstruction free launching area. The 61S electric trawler also benefits from Steeler's patented S design hull which affords this boat minimal spray and maximum interior volume. And check out those big windows. You can just imagine the views from inside, whether you are motoring through stormy seas or enjoying the view whilst at anchor in a remote bay. Note also the solar panels for a permanent and natural energy supply. Talking of natural energy supplies, let us not forget the wind turbines. Steeler has done an amazing job building this steel hulled electric trawler. Not only have they designed an ocean crossing trawler yacht that is propelled by an electric motor, but they, along with Repack and the owner of hull number one, have also created a stunning looking trawler yacht that for people like me who have been a fan of trawler yachts long before they became fashionable, gives us a glimpse into the future of trawler yacht design and propulsion. With the Steeler 61S electric trawler, not only are you getting an elegant, long-range steel-hulled explorer yacht, but you're also getting a state-of-the-art propulsion system that is ahead of the game when it comes to adopting electric motors aboard this genre of boat. Stay tuned for more updates about this incredible boat and let me know what you think by leaving a comment in the comment section. If you have got access to a boat that you would like me to feature on my YouTube channel, then please contact me either via my Instagram page or via email at john at yacht-boy.com. If you'd like to support my YouTube channel as it grows, then please consider becoming a channel member by clicking on the join button underneath the video or by sending me a super thanks. I'd like to say a big thanks to these amazing people who have already decided to become a member of my YouTube channel. Don't forget to check out my other videos and playlists. I also have a free newsletter that you can sign up for by clicking on the link in front of you now. And finally, don't forget to give this video a like because it means that more people on YouTube will get to see it. So until next time, fair winds and following seas.